Hello, welcome to the video. In this video, we are still discussing the exercise number 6-2. In this exercise, we need to compare the result with respect to the same three output performance measures and do an informal statistical comparison by making 20 replications of both versions of the model, forming 95% confidence interval and looking at the relationship between the confidence interval. Okay, so let's move to the exercise 6-2 model which I have already covered in the previous video tutorial okay so first we need to move to the advanced process template panel and under the advanced process template panel click this statistics module and here you can see the statistics advanced process spreadsheet is shown on your screen double click on it three times and then type average cycle time then average number machine one q so these are the actually statistics that we need to compare as mentioned in the text problem this is the average number machine to q next we need to define the type and here the type is output for all the parameters then we need to add the expression right click or click the build expression so first one is the average cycle time so move to the entity times or average total time and then click ok then repeat the same procedure for the rest of the measures but these two measures are related to the Q so here you need to select the average number in Q for machine 1 and here you need to select the Q related to the machine 2 so average number in Q related to the machine 2 that's it so for performing the output analysis, you need a .dat file and that file is created by using this output file format. So type here 6-2 average time. Simply type .dat. This file will be automatically created after running the simulation type 6-2 machine 1 q dot dat simply copy paste type machine 2 ok so it's done now save this file and run this model so let's fast forward it Okay, so as soon as the simulation is completed, so that .dat file would automatically be created in that folder where you actually save your current arena file. So simply let this know, no need to do the report, simply stop this simulation and now open the model 5-2. So you need to repeat the same step for this uh, model 2 for comparing purpose. So let's add more three statistics first one is again related to the average time second is the machine one q the last one is machine two q so these are actually average number machine one q and let's type it here average number machine one q average number machine two q and here also select the type as output okay so again repeat the same expression as we did in sys-2 so move to entity times and the average total time and uh, here q average number in q for machine 1 and here Q related to the machine 2 
and again you need to define the output file so type 5-2 you just compare both of the versions average time dot tat let's 5-2 machine 1 q dot tat and the last one is machine 2 to load dat okay it's done so now save this file and again run this model but make sure under the run parameter number of replication is 20 because we need to perform the simulation for 20 replications as assigned in the tax problem okay so simply click this okay and uh, save this file and now run it Let's pass forward it to view the results. Okay, so simply click this no button and store the simulation and save the file. So you can see we have did the same operation or for both of the files. Now we need to compare the output of both the exercises problem. But under the tool you didn't uh, found any uh, output analyzer option because this option would be uh, deal separately through the install window so you need to click this start menu button and under the road well folder simulation folder here you can see the output analyzer application simply click this button and then you can see the output analyzer window is open this output analyzer window is actually using that .dat file that was created previously. So first click this new button. So the output file data group is open. Now add all those data files. So move to that folder. Okay. So here you can see all the .dat files have shown or simply click this button and click open. Then repeat the same step for the rest of the files so one by one you need to add all the six dot dat file of both the text problems done next we need to uh, go to analyze and under compare means here you can see the compare mean window click this add button and first select the first data file that is average time and for data file that you need to compare with this data file average data file for six dash two and this one is 5 dash 2 and this one is 6 dash 2 and number of replications like lamp because we need to lamp the all the application as a single uh, unit or a file and then simply click this ok now click this add button again and click the setting option that is the average number machine 1 cube and now repeat the same step for the last one that is the machine 2 cube you can also did this thing one by one or separately. So you can add title if you want. So 95% confidence pair theta simply click this OK button. So here you can see the pair theta comparison of all the three performance measures: average cycle time, average number machine one Q, or average number machine two Q. Moreover. You can also uh, compare these parameters uh, separately because every cycle time is compared actually exercise 5-2 with 6-2 exactly for the rest of the performance menu. So in this window actually I am going to show all the required performance measure in a single output file. So here you can see further the pair t test statistics score values. So you can see fail to reject the H node means there is no difference between the average cycle time but average machine work where H node is rejected because means are not equal and means are not equal for machine number 2 in uh, compare with 5-2 with 6-2. So that concludes this video tutorial. Thank you.